In this tutorial, we'll go over how to render a keyboard in KRK2. First, let's turn the kits off in the Outliner. Boards can be found in the Asset Browser on the left, and they're categorized by form factor. Drag and drop one of them into the 3D viewport, and then zero out the transforms by pressing backspace over the location field, or simply press Alt-G. Where the board is still selected, press the Restore Collections button in the CareK panel to allow this to be editable. This time let's try Kyriev's cat profile by typing K-A-T into the profile and press Set. Find the caps mat in the asset browser and drag it onto one of the keycaps. To make that keycap active, hold shift and click on it so we can see the rest of our options here. Now press copy materials. Then if we press setup, we can see that all of our appropriate settings are applied. Now, we're still in uh, GMK's legend, so let's go ahead and load some cat-appropriate legends into this. These can be found in the legends repository on GitHub. I'll go ahead and load them in here. Let's go with an icon, but let's also grab the text. So now we can use our legend slider to change it over to text. Select all. Now, if I just go ahead and hit paste here, you'll see that it will just paste the uh, preloaded colors that were already in the index. We would like to use our own uh, colorway from the last video. But also note that the legend position is also pasted. Keep that in mind. Let's go ahead and import our previous colorway, poison dart, import color. Now all that's needed is to hit paste. There we go. Um, to make it interesting, let's switch these icons over to text and leave just the bottom row as, as the icons. Okay. Now, if you have all these selected um, and they're starting off on the same position, you can hold Alt while you're dragging to do them all at once. Otherwise, uh, just do the one and then press the copy button. Like that. There we go. Now let's go ahead and add a floor in here. Uh, floor wood six. That looks nice. And we need to move it down to allow for a desk mat. Let's add a desk mat in. Minus three mil. There we go. To allow a space for the desk mat. Let's go in here and grab our thoughts desk mat and Alt-G to reset it. Uh, we also need to do a minus three on that. And if you want to edit it, you need to uh, click on Restore Collection and select it. And, uh, oh, we have our thickness set to four. Set that down to three, because we have three in the other things. Um, maybe when I was making that uh, default, I was dreaming of having a supple, thick desk mat. Um, any other accessories here? How about a mouse? Just drag that on there. Uh, see, it, it's below the surface, so just uh, shift right click to set the 3D cursor and shift S and uh, selection to cursor just to pull that up. 
RZ, give it a little rotation. Okay, how about a keycap puller maybe somewhere? Same thing, just uh, set it. There we go. And uh, how about a cable? I'll just do the uh, straight cable for now. Same thing, uh, gotta move it somewhere. GY, kind of put that all there. And uh, yep, restore G shift X so it doesn't move on the X and uh, plug it in. There we go. Um, we just need uh, to set up our camera now. I'll also set up a GPU compute since we're rendering with the GPU. We don't have to do that. All right, um, lights. Let's get some lights in there. Go with the tent two. Turn off the regular kit lighting. Cameras. Uh, go over here and click the little blue, uh, green icon. And let's look through our camera tilde and view camera, and it's not where we want it. So. Uh, what you can do here is just uh, lock camera to view and rotate around so we got something a bit more interesting. Let me go a little lower. Uh, we won't get our cable after all. Okay. Uh, yeah, I want to be higher here. Not bad. And how about some depth of field? Uh, Click on depth of field here and sample. We can just take a shortcut and sample the five maybe. So we just get that in focus. And uh, f-stop here, uh, smaller number means more blur. And uh, okay, let's hit render. Render, render image. Let's have a look at that. Okay, there we go, not too bad.